Hello, hello. Oh God. Okay. So, um, as you can. Oh fuck. It's one of the one of my fail no favorite games. <laughs> we'll talk later. <laughs> Let's play the game. Oh, and I already start the game because I I played on PS2 and PF, PS5, but not on PC, so I'll stick to the keyboard for now. long ago, a tiny hamlet known as Kamiki lays nestly in a grove of proud and beautiful cherry blossom. Each and every tree around the quiet berg, berg? berg. was honored as a god. However, the village was not without its dark secrets. To, sat uh, to satiate the appetite of Oroshi, a fearsome cave-dwelling beast, a young maiden was offered as a sacrifice at the annual festival. With a body like a mountain and eight heads <laughs> mounted on necks the size of the tree trunks, its blood red eyes alone were said to curse anyone who gazed into them. No one dared disobey the horrific beast. When the night of the sacrifice drew near, a mysterious white wolf appeared outside the village. This wolf, its coat as brilliant, 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 for fuck's sake, <laughs> as snow, was uh, dubbed Shiranui. The wolf kept a watchful eyes on anyone who ventured outside the village and made a habit of patrolling the, tr the street that night. People assumed the, the wolf to be a familiar of Oroshi. The villager took it upon it himself to face the fearsome Shiranui. The warrior Nagi attempted many times to challenge the wolf, but his attempts were, were thwarted by Shiranui's swift movements. Before long, the night of the accursed uh, festival sorry, had arrived. A white plum plumbed arrow uh, heralded the coming sacrifice. Pursing the sky, the arrow sunk its staff squarely to. The home of Nami, the villager's most beautiful maiden. Nagi harbor, harboring a secret love for Nami, was enraged by the sign. Determined to put an end to Oroshi's, Oroshi once and for all, Nagi traveled to the beast. Uh, travel to the beast's cave in place to his beloved. But the beloved, sorry. <laughs> the moon cave, a place of dark, as dark as evil itself, served as Oroshi's home. As Nagi stood 
bravely before the entrance, a beast appears. Uh, a beast appeared, eyes glowing crimson upon eight thrashing necks. Although she stood tall before him, anxious for another sacrifice, Nagi lived with incredible grace, swinging his blade valiantly. On and on he sliced, well into the moonless night, but Orochi's hide was like steel, the blade left nary a scorch. Oh, nary a scorch, okay. At long last, Nagi, his energy spent from the intense battle, dropped to his knees, fatigue, and gasping for breath. He knew he was staring dead in the face. It was then that the wolf appeared. As if to protect Nagi, it stood. It stood its ground before Orochi. In the dark, in the darkness of the cave, the wolf coat, wolf's coat shone brilliantly. Alas, it was, it was Shiranui, the wolf that dwelled outside the village. Bearing its fearsome claws, Shiranui leap, leaped toward Orochi. Orochi reached its terrifying head. Reading its fangs for battle. <laughs> so readying his fang for battle, sorry. The two be struggling wildly, uh, trashing in the darkness. <laughs> Mysterious and terrifying, the spectacle continued. Shiranui summoned gust of divine wind to counter Shiranui uh, of uh, Oroshi flames. Oops. <laughs> As Oroshi closed in on Shiranui, sharpened claws glistening, a, gig a gigantic tree suddenly sprang. Routed fort shielding the wolf. She only fell gall gallantly to gain the upper hand. However, was she protected by a mystical what? protected by your mystical power was not easily beasted uh, bested. She only covered in gash. Majestic coat and crimson. That <laughs> stood exhausted before the might, mighty Orochi. Orochi saw a chance to strike. That will be the final blow. But she ran away, refused to give in. With its last hounds of strength, the majestic wolf gazed heaven, heavenward and unleashed a mighty howl. Suddenly, so the black cloud overhead, overhead disappeared. Uh, whatever this. Uh, <laughs> Dissipated. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, brain. The light from above uh, glinted off Nagi's sword as it become as a oh, fucking hell. I can fucking read. The light from above glinted off Nagi's sword as a beacon of hope. Guided by his sword, Nagi, who has been taking shelter 
in the shadows stood proudly to face his adversary, channeling all his strength to his sacred and battered arms. He leaped furiously toward Orochi, his sword blade. Blazed high, the golden sword danced in his hands like a puppet on a string. One by one, one, one by one, Orochi's fearsome heads separated from their owner. She broken body collapsed in a lake of its own blood. In, in that instant, the curse, the curse that plagued the village, the villager was lifted. <coughs> As the battle subsisted, the sun shone once again in the sky. Shiranui has succumbed to Orochi's poison. And struggle to breath. Nagi scooped the beast into his arm and returned to Kamiki. When they reached the village, Shiranui was no longer no longer moving. The village elder gently stroke a wolf, uh, the wolf's head. In response, Shiranui let out the Horse, or oh. that's not a fucking horse. Horse that. Oh. 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 Horse and pitiful bark. What else? <laughs> then closed his eyes and drift off as if into slumber. Bees. Bees had at last returned to Kamiki village. In honor of Shiranui's heroic exploit, the villager erected a shrine and pla placed <coughs> a statue of the wolf within it. Within it. Oh my god, sorry. <coughs> Nagi's sword was christened Tsukuyumi and placed inside the moon cave. The villagers all looked forward for a, to an age of endless peace. However, <laughs> This is not the end of the story. <laughs> there is more to this tale than most people know. One hundred years have, have passed since Nagi and Shiranui's heroic exploit. It happened so quickly that no one in the village even took notice. Fuck's sake, you fucking moron. <sighs> There's always a part of truth in the fairy tale, guys. Oh, who, uh, oh, he who seek power. He who has broken my bounds. Speak the words. I wish darkness into the world. Utter that prayer into me and unleash my power.
gotta go fast. We must act quickly. There is no time to lose. My power has diminished over the years I've spent protecting this area. I don't have much time left in this world. Amaterasu, now is the time. We have never handed. Uh, we have never needed your power more. Shine your divine light upon this broken and polluted world. Let your heavenly rays become our hope as you guide us all. Oh, little baby. Such divine white light, such beauty and grace. The only one capable of such a wondrous spectacle is none other than our mother and the origin of all, that is, Amaterasu. How delightful to see that the Savior, whose brave sacrifice sealed away the evil demon so many years ago, has not changed one bit. Seeing you emerge after so many years spent as a statue brings happiness to my heart. Sniff. Tamaterasu. Gaze above you and take in the condition of the sky. Untimely departure from our mid midst, the world has succumbed to devious and vicious beasts. They have rava ravaged refined and bountiful the country of Nippon. Never have, uh, never have the circ circumstance been worse than they are at the very moment. Please use your power to banish the darkness and punish those who will do us harm. Hmm. Hey, what is this? <gasps> has something stole? Uh, has something stolen its way into my robe? Ho ho ho. Ho he he he. Ha 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 ha. Phew. What on earth? 
you again. Little bird. Oh. Ow, 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 ow. Are you nuts? Boy, for your little thing. You sure make a big fuss? I was just trying to make the conversation a bit more interesting, that's all. Were you napping in my clothes again, bug? Bug? I told you a thousand times not to call me that. I'm a wandering artist. The name's... Isuan. Isuan? This one, this one, I guess. This one? Not sure. Wandering artist, this one. I'll show you just how great I am. And it won't be long till you're bowing before my great brush. That's nice. Well, what do you think? Even cuter than the real thing, no? <laughs> What's with you, Furball? You look ki kinda down in the dumps. Actually, you look kinda familiar. Got it. You look just like that sta statue of Shiranui. Oh, what you think you're doing? Are you crazy? A handsome guy like me shall never be, be covered in wolf slumber. You'll regret messing with the great Isuan. Don't make me use my prized sword, Ding Komaru, against you. What's that growling, growl, growling sound? <laughs> and why, why is it so dark anyway? I don't know. <laughs> oh great God, I'm a terrorist. I've used all my power I have to protect Kamiki Village. The village lives on. Their spirits lies in. Uh, and case it in my fruit. Cut it, cut it free, and the village will be reborn. I trust in you. I know that you will lead us down the right path. Only your awesome power can restore life to the world. The trees return to normal, eh? That Sakuya girl. Sure said some weird stuff. The villager spirits are being kept inside the fruit. That's the fruit. That girl should say that. If you got it down, the village will be restored. But it's awfully high up there. If you don't use some kind of special power, there is no way you're gonna reach it. This darkness is really getting into me too. A lot can happen while, while you're taking a nap. Okay, so I'll just go inside. Uh, yeah. Here we go. Okay. Where are we? I got awful. It got awfully quiet all of a sudden. I don't remember any place like this in the village. Well, we better keep our eyes peeled. You can use the mouse <laughs> to look around. <laughs> See, to change your point of view. But you really look so helpless. You sure you're gonna be okay? Uh, we'll see. So, okay. So, like I was saying, uh, not so long ago, oh boy, okay, <laughs> 20 minutes ago, <laughs> um, this is a game I really, really love, it's one of my 
probably top 5 game that I played in my life. Um, so as I said, uh, I played uh, so many times the PS2 uh, version and I played the HT1 on PS4. Um, so I, I know the game. I know the game. I'll try to uh, make it supporter free. So the f that first episode gonna be a, will probably be a longer one since the introduction is very long. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. We are going to start even Amaterasu is sleeping. I, I talk too much. Okay. Uh, uh, oh shit. Okay, I need to change that. Uh, no. Yes. Okay. Yes. That's better. Okay. So, like I said, I already played a lot. Uh, I played a little bit on the PC just to uh, see um, how it was like uh, I'm okay for now with the keyboard so it, it should be okay I didn't go too uh, too far in the game I was maybe uh, 10 minutes after this point just to use a little bit uh, the, the keyboard that's an origin mirror they say once you, your reflection appears on the on its surface, your memories will be stored in the mirror for all eternity. Well, to put it shortly, you can save your progress here. <laughs> and let me give you a little advice. You should save a number of game files. That way you could always go back if you get stuck or something. Gotta, gotta be prepared, especially while you're still learning the ropes. Yup, yup. Okay. So, here you go. This is where I, I played. Uh, I'm gonna save on this one. Yay! Okay, let's do uh, this. Oh boy, oh boy. That's weird. Uh, look at all those spots. Just waiting to be broken. <laughs> uh, what time is it? If you pass them, there might be something good inside. Whip, whip, whip. I know this, I know this. But in Way to go, my furry friend! You can do that anytime you see something you can break. All good. Here we go. <laughs> I was going to say Link, but as a wolf, but Twilight Princess already did that, so I can't. Okay, maybe a female wolf link. Mm -hmm, that's it. I'm so dark, what the fuck? Uh, sorry, I thought that it will be more, there will be more natural lightning. I didn't install anything for that. Anyway. Whoa, whoa. Hold on there, furball. Get a load of that. That shit. That that just looked mighty tempting. Mm -hmm. Let's go check that out. Getting getting up that high gotta be a piece of cake. Press space to jump, then press space again to do a wall jump. Yes, yes, but make sure you press it firmly so you jump really high. So, okay, you gotta be here. Oh shit, I didn't do the right thing. Fucking hell. Ah, that's it. Okay. <laughs> I knew 
you could do it. They said, they say, good luck is found in high places. So keep your eyes peeled. We don't want to miss any treasure. God no we don't. Yup 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 Okay Treasure treasure Holy bones <laughs> I'm at that as your favorite snacks <laughs> Oh boy. Okay, I can. I can jump off the hill. That's nice. Looks like the bridge is out. This shouldn't, shouldn't be so hard, hmm? Amaterasu, wasn't it? That's kinda long. Might I call, might I call you Amy? Listen, Amy. Have you ever heard of the spirits of the brush? Good, uh, good, good brush, brushwork has its own soul. At least that's what they say. Just watch. It take all. It take all day to explain. A picture's word, a thousand word, right? Nice, huh? Just a little technique I've mastered called rejuvenation. It's one of many. It's one of many brush techniques that use divine power. It's a brush god. It, uh, it's a brush. It's a brush god power that can restore broken and missing things. I've practiced really hard just to master this one technique, but there are thirteen. It, each one is a power of one of the. Uh, each one is a power of one of the 13 brush gods. Originally, all 13 were a single powerful deity. Deity? 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 When the deity died, its power was split into uh, 13 separate gods. The gods now dwell within objects all around us. All around us, but gods are no god. How could anyone have the power to master all thirteen? Well, <laughs> maybe a certain wolf named Amaterasu. River of the Heaven. Uh, sorry, give me a sec. The river of the heaven. Do you mean the fable Stardust River? But I sure don't see anything like that around here. It couldn't be that little bundle over here, could it? Okay. Nope, I already saw it. I need to go up. What is happening? Wow, look at the stars twinkles. Twinkle. I haven't seen such a beautiful nighttime sky in ages. Hey, look, are those stars forming a pattern? Or is it just me? Hmm, not sure. <laughs> hmm, there's one missing. Guess I'll just have to draw the missing star. That 
Looks like I'm just not ready for draw missing star. Press control to hold the brush, then so <laughs> to draw. I sure spend a heck of a lot of time practicing that mumble. Yeah, oh boy. Wow! It's magic! Ah, uh, why if it isn't Mother Amateras? I apologize for not contacting you sooner during these long years. Having never forgotten you, I, Yomigami, God of Restoration, have eagerly awaited this day when we could again meet. While you were away, the thirteen spirits of the brush that you want possess possess uh, possess 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 uh, include myself I've been scattering across this land of men and now lie in disarray I become I became a constellation and managed to survive until now the time has come for you to seek out and reunite all the techniques your power is what is needed to restore the dry river dead of the heavens and re renew the flow of stardust. Oh, yeah. Wow, that was. Yomi Kami, the god of rejuvenation. Re Wait, so you have the power of rejuvenation re now? Can you really use it to restore the river of the heavens? That will mean you, you were as good with a uh, with a brush as you you that <gasps> boy what am i doing <laughs> that will mean you were as good with a brush as yours truly nah it couldn't be true who else could master this incredible god techniques give me the pots money Thank you very much. Yes, I know. Wonder if drawing some stardust, stardust will get the river flowing again. Nah, it's one thing to fix a bridge, but fixing a starry river? There's no way you could put off a stun like that. <laughs> Just watch me. See that? Oh boy, oh boy, I'm so s uh, boy, I need to change the sensibility of this mouse. Hmm. A river of stardust. So this really must be the river of the heavens. But that, uh, what I really want to know is who the heck drew that the damn things? Well, me, duh. Good, good, good. Wow! Uh, did I do it or did I miss this? Ah, okay. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Astral Barge. Look what you found. For this Astral Barge. Here's amazing. It can swallow up a lot of food. Then, when it's full, it can revive its owner if he or she dies. Let's, tar let's start 
feeding it with whatever food we can find around here. How convenient. There's some apple and orange here. But not here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But there. Way. Oh, 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 oh. What's that? Beach. Hmm. Orange. Thank you, pretty much. Uh, what? Let me two second to. So so so, this will be it for now. Um, so yeah. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you will like this. Uh, this uh, video game as I do. Um. Don't f forget to subscribe and leave a like if you want to see more of those. Uh, if you have any suggestion too for uh, any layout, if you want me to play another game or if you want me to, uh, I don't know, speak less or I don't know, whatever. If you have any suggestion, uh, you can always comment below and uh, you can always see uh, in the description below uh, where you can find the game and who made them. Uh, so you don't have to ask me where you can find it. And obviously probably most of the game that I will play will be available on, on Steam <laughs> or Origin. So yeah, that will be all for me now. Uh, I hope you liked it. I know I said it so many fucking times, but I really hope you liked it. Or, I mean, I hope you will like it. Because it was only the introduction and we are technically uh, still in the tutorial area. So yeah, I will see you guys on the next one. Thank you. <laughs>